Remember when Ajax was a buzzword? That was around the same time jQuery appeared in the web ecosystem. Ajax meant nothing more than using XHR to dynamically load content into your website. But it turned out that XHR is a pretty hard API to use, and jQuery provided a much simpler Ajax function that was quickly adopted by web developers. Now the web platform offers Fetch, a promise-based modern replacement for the old XHR with a couple of similarities to jQuery's Ajax function. This might not be news to you, as anyone who has written a service worker is probably familiar with Fetch, but it was jQuery that showed that XHR was not a good developer experience. Fetch is somewhat newer, at least compared to the other APIs that we talked about, and is supported in all modern browsers, but not IE 11. There is, however, a couple of high-fidelity polyfills out there for you to use. Man, Ajax. It's been a while since you heard that one, isn't it? Well, if you find this whole jQuery stuff interesting, you should subscribe because we have some more videos coming. And in the meantime, you can watch some other supercharged videos right here.